Hello YouTube, Robert here. Imagine this is a sinker, it's a billing wire. I don't know if you can make out that knot. The reason why I'm showing you this knot is the, the clips that I'm going to show you, I'm going to show you these knots actually uh, failing in action. My buddy Adrian, when me and him went fishing at the Jordan River, he lost two really nice cats. And he, I asked him to show me how he tied the knots. So I tied these knots exactly the way he did. Now these knots, they seem really strong and everything like that. So these knots should not have failed. So I'm going to show you the, the clips right now of, of these knots actually failing in action. And then uh, I will show you how, how to tie them. How these knots were tied. So, thanks. One of my theories is, is when I tied this, see how the, the line's all wrinkled? I'm wondering if that got, if that weakened the line when you are pulling these tight. So that's another possibility of what could have happened. Adrian with a really good sized cat on, good sized channel. Can you lift them up, or do you have to go over there and drag them up? Oh! Holy shit. Took my hook. Took the hook. Okay, Adrian's got a really good one. Oh, fuck. I lost everything. He lost everything, right? Dude, I even lost my fucking sinkers. I mean... How the hell did that happen? You even lost the sinkers? Yeah. Okay. As you can see, those are two nice cats that got away from Adrian. And here's those knots that I showed you at the very beginning of the video. Well, he showed me the correct way to tie these and the incorrect way of tying the, this knot. And he believes that he must have tied it the incorrect way. I don't know if you can see that, the knot, the knot that I showed you. See, I'm pulling on it really hard. Look what happened. Knot came undone. It didn't, the line didn't break. The knot came undone. Knot came undone. So, I had another talk with Adrian, and he told me, yeah, he most likely tied those knots incorrectly. Now I'll show you how he told me the correct way of doing it. So this is how he ties knots, folks. <clears throat> So you got your loop, okay? To me, I think it's a difficult knot not to do. But I'll show you. So you have this, and with your tag in, you know your loop, with your tag in, start wrapping it on the opposite side of the loop. So I'm holding it right here, and then you just keep on twisting. <clears throat> so I'm pulling with the main line, pulling with the tag end, and then when you get to this point, Grab a hold of your hook, your sinker, or whatever, swivel, and then hold the tag with that, and then pull. There it is, folks. Now the hook is nice and tight. Yeah. So, 
Now let me show you the incorrect way. Same thing. But instead of with the tag end wrapping around the right way on the, the this side of the loop, you're wrapping the tag this to this side of the loop. Instead of that, the first time you showed me, he was wrapping it on the right side of the loop. It looks like it tightens up really nice and neat. Same thing, hold on to the hook and the tag in, but then the hook comes undone. So, <clears throat> that's how it happened, folks. So, when you get to this point, if you choose to use a, a try and knot like this, when it gets to this point, Always wrap your tag on to the left side of the loop, not the right. It feels awkward when you're doing it, but once you get it started, once you get it started, it, it's uh, not that bad. It's actually quite easy. Me, on the other hand, I personally do not like this knot. I think it's a, it's uh, hard to do and uh, I just prefer the knots that I showed you on my last video. Sponge it out. Boom. There you go. Alright, so uh, I showed you the knots that my friend Adrian uses when we went fishing and he lost those two cats and I showed you the incorrect way to tie in those and the correct way of tying them. Alright, thanks YouTube. Like if you like, subscribe if you want. Have a good one.